Hey, what's up guys? Pase Baller here. We are now on this 10th uh, or the last game or prediction for this January 9, 2022 NBA game day. This is the battle between Memphis Grizzlies with a record of 27-14 and 14, going up against the home team Los Angeles Lakers now with a record of 21-19. and 19. This one will be played 9.30 p.m. Eastern Time, so that's 10.30 a.m. here in Manila. And before we proceed, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pass a Baller, please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. All right. Um, first off, let's uh, take a look at the uh, Western Conference standings for these two teams. Uh, starting with the Memphis Grizzlies, man, they are at number four in the West. For their last ten games, they have won. For their last ten games, they have won eight. That's crazy, man. Eight out of ten. And approaching this game, they are on an eight-game winning streak. Okay, Chicago got nine game. Yeah, sorry, I had to check that. Um, uh, for Los Angeles Lakers, they are actually at number six, and they have been winning and they have been improving. They are at number 6 now. For their last 10 games, they have won 5. And approaching this game, they are on a 4-game winning streak. Alright, so Los Angeles Lakers, they will be uh, the home, they will be the uh, yeah, the host on this in Crypto.com Arena. Um, so they have that advantage for fatigue factor. Uh, they would also have the advantage because Memphis Grizzlies already played yesterday um, against the Clippers in the same arena. Um, and for momentum, uh, even though both have been winning, I still got to give it to Memphis Grizzlies, man. That's eight-game winning streak. Come on, man. Uh, if you are on such uh, on such a uh, streak, I'm pretty sure that you know they feel like they, they are beatable. Um, so uh, let's check on the injury list for both teams. For Memphis Grizzlies, we got Pons, uh, Concher, uh, Tillman, Anderson, Adams out. So those are five players, man. While Dylan Brooks and Jam Morant are on game time decision um, or day to day. So uh, we need to wait uh, for any updates for these two players. Memphis Grizzlies, five players are out, possibly seven, depending on Morant and Brooks. Now for Los Angeles Lakers, uh, they are, uh, their health is actually improving. Um, Anthony Davis and Kendrick Nunn, they are out. Um, LeBron James is uh, listed down here, but you know, highly likely he would still play. I'm looking at the spread, and as we speak, uh, it is a minus three for the home team, Los Angeles Lakers, and um, I understand what the you know uh, what the odds makers um, are doing. Um, they gotta give it to they gotta give some credits for Los Angeles Lakers who have been winning lately. Four game winning streak is no easy task in the NBA, man. Uh, and of course, Los Angeles Lakers is at home. And they, they are also considering that uh, Memphis Grizzlies are actually um, playing back-to-back because -back they played last night or yesterday. Um, and they have a very, you know, they have a very good um, reason uh, for that minus three. Um, Los Angeles Lakers should really be the favorite on this team. We ain't even sure if Ja Morant is playing on this game. Uh, for Dylan Brooks, I, I really don't know. But, you know, he, when he twisted that ankle yesterday, it really looked bad. I, I feel like he would, you know, he would need some time to rest that ankle. Um, uh, for this one, I'm going to, I'm going to be honest. Um, I feel like uh, Memphis Grizzlies, I, I, I want to side with the Memphis Grizzlies. Um, I feel like Memphis Grizzlies right now, even though they don't have Jamarant, uh, they have the capability of figuring out any team on how to beat him. Um, remember when uh, Jamarant wasn't uh, was not playing for Memphis Grizzlies? Memphis Grizzlies had a run of their own. I don't know, maybe that was a seven-game winning streak or something. Now uh, that there's even a chance that Jamarant would be playing, I'm gonna side with the uh, Memphis Grizzlies, man. Um, and we all know. Um, Los Angeles Lakers, uh, they have, um, you know, they have a possibility of some of sometimes, you know, uh, messing it up towards the end or something like that. Um, we'll see, we'll see, because uh, I, I gotta admit, um, Carmelo Anthony off the bench uh, for Los Angeles Lakers have been very solid, man. When they needed points and you know they sit down LeBron or Westbrook, Carmelo Anthony was there and his shooting, his shooting is actually back, man. His shooting is crazy. Um, so it's, it's really tough. If you don't have much funds, I would suggest for you to just skip this one. But if you really need to, if you really want to know what my take on this is, 
It's going to be Memphis Grizzlies plus 3. I'm going to ride with their momentum. Grizzlies plus 3. Peace out. Pass love and God bless.